Very good afternoon. Welcome to Edgeley Park. It feels as if county season is really coming to the boil now as Simon Rusk's side go in search of their third win in a row and close in on those playoff places. Straight to the team news. Well, after coming off the bench to score the winner and change the game at Weymouth last weekend, there is a home debut for new signing Ollie Crankshaw as he replaces Alex Reid in a front three. And two changes at the back as well. Fit again, Jordan Keane replaces skipper Liam Hogan, while Zeki Fryers returns to replace teenage defender Ethan Pye who also impressed last weekend in the win on the south coast with a very mature and composed first competitive appearance county will come again though Palmer fries its relentless pressure from county in this opening five minutes Kitching's in behind great run from Kitching inside the penalty area the Cheadle end up on their feet hoping for a penalty Kitching felt he was clipped there by Giles Phillips referee Marsden doesn't want to know goal kick Back to Southam Hales, real attacking threat down this right side for County today with those two. Crowsdale helping out, couldn't find Crankshaw that time, but Crankshaw's won it back nonetheless and he's away. Amazing run from Crankshaw across the face of goal, comes to Southam Hales who couldn't guide it into the top corner. A tame effort, it came at him rather quickly from Ben Whitfield. Oxlade Chamberlain, concede, or wins a throw in I should say. Here's Willard inside the box, twisting and turning. He's shaken off the attention of the defender, and in the end, it took a little nick off Ash Palmer as he closed him down. The shot coming in from Willard. Bennings. Phillips striding forward from that centre half position. Oxlade Chamberlain on the right, tucks it inside to Whittingham. Just inside county territory with Bennings again. Willard coming in off that right touch line. Looking for a little one-two with Edsa. It's come off. This is a chance for the opener. What a block by the goalkeeper. Brilliant stop from Ethan Ross. Uses left foot to good effect. Willard. Looks a good player, Willard, coming off that right side. The corner, not too well defended. Our Ashri are on the turn, deflected. It's another corner. Kinsella with the corner. Outswinger, headed away by Crowsdale only as far as Whittingham who heads it back in towards our Ashria. didn't quite reach him or Willard our Ashria is still there though looking to hold off the challenge of Keane and now the Hatters can break as they get the ball away Whitfield oh he stayed on his feet brilliantly With more yellow shirts behind the ball now Crankshaw wide left at the moment looking to switch it if he can Jordan Keane joining the attack County on the counter-attack. Southam Hales to cross from the right. It's not the best of headers away. And Crowsdale on the volley. Couldn't direct it goalwards. Swift counter-attack from the home side. Back to Jordan Keane again. Keane who's recovered from the hamstring injury that's kept him out for the last few weeks. Southam Hales bursting forward down the right wing. Needs support. Gets it from Crowsdale. Now Keane. Keane will just loft this in towards the far post but again Whitfield not the play he'd want but Kitching's closing in and here's Madden to direct it goalwards appeals of handball not given and then from the rebound Southam Hales fires over at the other end Southam Hales with probably County's best chance it came at him a bit quickly but uh, probably should have hit the target here's Edsa bursting forward from midfield he's left Crowsdale in a heap He's got past Friars, out to the right wing for Corey Andrews to drill it across. Our Ashria should have scored. That was a real chance. He got goal side of Jordan Keane. Keane, arm raised. Rooney plays it down the line instead to Whitfield, who drives forward, crosses it to the far post for Madden! County lead by a goal to nil. It's three and three for the Irish front man. A cleverly worked free kick routine from John Rooney down the line to Whitfield. A pinpoint cross to the far post. Madden does it again in stoppage time at the end of the first half. It's County 1, Aldershot Town 0. Our Ashry has not really caused too many problems for Ash Palmer so far. Just a little bit isolated at the minute, isn't he? Yeah. Rooney. Loses out to Vennings. Vennings breaks down that left side. Chance maybe for a, a cross from that left wing. County, though, have blocked that. 
Comes out to Edsa. Change of angle. Not the most convincing clearance from Ash Palmer. The shots will come again with the dangerous and lively Corey Andrews. Clever ball through the gap. The shot brilliantly blocked by Southam Hales. That is wonderful work from Southam Hales. How on earth he got there before, uh, I mean, Tommy Willard thought when he pulled the trigger that was destined for the bottom corner. Brilliant block by Southam Hales, who's now in the opposition half. So county corner, Rooney to take. We're in such a hurry to get these subs on, but they'll wait until they defended this corner. It just sails over everyone's heads, and it's recycled, though, on the opposite side. Southam Hales hooks it goalwards, and it's touched onto the bar. Oh, County then missing the rebound. Crowsdale, though, no route forward. Goes back to Ethan Ross, who immediately, first time, pings it forward. Out to the right flank, looking for Crankshaw. Headed away by Cody Lyons-Foster. Oh, that's great from Andrews. Brilliant turn. Keane seems to be struggling. The shot from distance flashes over the bar. Gets away with it. But they're struggling to clear the lines here. All the shots out. And there's a turnover on the halfway line as County now spring a counter-attack. Rooney picking out Whitfield. He's isolated the defender. It's Whitfield goes for goal. It was a tame effort, though, straight at the goalkeeper. I think he knows that Jordan Keane starting to flag just a little bit yeah I think you have to, to look at making the change now I think John Keane to his credit I think he's been very good today on the whole but like you say just starting to flag a little bit ball over the top from Edsa Fries has done well to hook it away the danger's not passed yet though shot from distance straight at the goalkeeper stinging effort from Whittingham then the cross from Oxlade Chamberlain oh Keane again didn't quite know what to do with it needed some help from a teammate needed a shout never got one been very very impressive this afternoon Andrews but it's to County's credit they've kept him quiet five goals so far this season for all the shot here's Southam Hales on the overlap right side looking for Madden who tried that little flick so the visitors have it back Whittingham Edsa Kinsella with the cross looking for Bettimer as a reliable target man in the middle it's awkward for Kit for uh, Kitching he gets it away but he had very little help and support, and the cross comes in again from the right-hand side, this time from Whittingham. It's overhit. It's kept in play by Andrews, who pulls it back to Vennings. Options on the right side again. This is good pressure from Aldershot Town. Oxlade Chamberlain's cross. Hogan's there to meet it, nods it clear. Paddy Madden couldn't quite get there, though. And Aldershot looking fresh, despite that trip to Dover in midweek. And this is why Simon's maybe looking at, at Scott Quigley because it's just not sticking up top for County. And here's Enjoli with a shot. It's hit the upright. Wagstaff with the throw deep in County territory, finding Enjoli. County switched off from that throw in. Really switched off. And Rydell's going mad at Zeki Fryers there. They might be in the relegation zone, but they're making a real fight of it here. Lions Foster couldn't manufacture the shot. Enjoli does, hits his own man. The, it comes back out to the edge of the box for Enjoli. Hand ball there by Hogan, he couldn't do much about it, but it certainly struck his arm. The county scramble it away. I mean, he's just kicked it past the defender and ran after it and left him for dead. Kinsella, no way he could catch him. But here come Aldershot again, this could be the last throw of the dice for the shots. Wide left, Wagstaff. Good deep ball towards Lyons Foster, who heads it goalwards. Ethan Ross gathers it. It's the last action of what's been an excellent game. An older shot have played their part today. They will not be in the drop zone for long if they keep playing like that. But Stockport County have claimed all three points with a dogged and determined performance this afternoon. The goal hero once again was Paddy Madden, right on the stroke of half-time. 